What's up, everybody? Welcome to Parish, Florida. This is Jose from Sun Life. And Katie! You can actually go straight. I can? Yeah, and nice. then when you get to the next intersection, you'll take a left. Okay. Which, uh, I mean, uh, your left will be called Erie. It'll be uh, the next major intersection. We are in Parish, Florida, and it's called Parish because, well, it's about to perish. Go on the other line. Yeah, it's about to end. Go, 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 go. Well, your driving is not acceptable to my standards. You had the option of driving. You chose to have it's me not drive. The now you of can driving. I'm in a lot of pain, bro. <laughs> I don't know. There's a Ola May Sims Park here. Take a left at that light. We're gonna get on Highway 62, and we're gonna drive. Clear through where the crap we're at now. Pass. Yeah. This town will eventually perish. Right, but right now it's growing. <laughs> yeah, it's it's, it's almost it'll, it'll perish one day. So when you get to um. Hey, I'm just gonna let Sarah talk Continue because you're not listening to me very well. I'm gonna, you, I'm gonna let Siri do the talking because apparently me talking hasn't worked very well for you getting directions today. No. <clears throat> this town will eventually perish. In a quarter mile, Ooh, look turn left onto 122nd Avenue East. Well, at least you're not listening to Siri either. Am I taking it left here? You didn't hear me, you didn't hear Siri. Because you, you were talking you over Siri. Well, you're talking over me now. Take a left. Turn left onto 122nd Avenue Just East, then turn right onto 81st Street go, East. Go to the light. Go to the light, take a left. I, I want you to go down that road for uh, someone. Turn right onto 81st Street East. Los Primos. Head east on Erie Road toward US 301 South, then turn left onto US 301 North. Turn left onto US 301 North, then turn right onto Florida 62 East. Go right by as an escalator. Go. Go, go, go. And you see where that box truck came out of? Yeah. Turn right onto Florida 62 East. For being a major road, it sure as crap is hard to find it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, guys, now we're finally on highway. Continue on Florida 62 East for 19 miles. Alright. This town will perish. Uh huh. I'm in so much pain, I don't even think I can sit here. Gotta do so we can earn. Oh, dude, so much Why do they have FWC at a construction site? Is there a gator That's here? That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life. They probably don't have anybody else to cover it. Yeah. What's up, dog? You playing with your beard, dog? They probably don't have enough officers to cover it. Yeah. But they can also just get hired for like private. Mm -hmm. yeah. like There's too many like Florida bed sightings, so they have to send the wildlife officers. Yeah, it's yeah. The last thing you're going to see around here left is any wildlife. Mm -hmm. Bowling Green, Kentucky is 41 miles away. Bowling Green, Florida, Jose. Bowling Green, Florida. This is Highway 62. Wachula Road. <laughs> Drive to some rural areas. Lake Parish is up ahead. And uh, we're gonna we're heading towards Bartow. Bartow with the Arto. Some farmland from here on. Yeah. Oh snap, he's passing them in an illegal manner. That's illegal, son. You're not supposed to do that. If Grady Judd catches you, you're going to get a new husband out the county jail. I think we're still in Manatee County. Are we still in Manatee County? Yeah. I think we are in Manatee County still. Well, we'll be in Polk County soon. They'll straighten him right out. They know that person still sells staghorns. They got some huge ones. Have you ever sold a staghorn? Mm -hmm. Have you ever eaten a staghorn, Katie? 
new communities going on way out here too. Yeah. I thought this was all in woods. It's like all new communities. Oh, it's all new communities. The crap. This town really will perish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like we're gonna grow to a small rural town. It was like two story suburbs. Down there with the suburb with the upper. Don't look like the house is off the Rugrats. I know, right? Yeah. Rugrat looking houses. I'm in so much pain right now. What are millennials all growing up and decide they all wanted the house that the Rugrats had? Stu and Dee Dee had? Stu and Dee Dee Pickles. So Let's get the house like Stu and Dee Dee Pickles for our kids. I don't know if I'm going to make it today. You're going to have to make it. Things that I've heard. <laughs> what the crap <laughs> was that, dude? No, no, no. I'll just scream. Can you like, not like <laughs> me? Can you not scream at me? I'm right Can next you to not burr? Don't duck there, June and me. All day long, she's been like burr, burr, burr. I added the burr. Damn. It's just an agony. I hope it hurts because it's getting better, but I don't know. Colonial stall house right there. I don't see too many of those in Florida. Nice. The Davis Stable. Okay, maybe from here on there's no more new communities. What is that? There's like two pipes in the air. Smoke sack. You go from like gay communities destroying the land to like mosaic destroying the land right around here. What the crap will be left of Florida? I love angering old people. I like angering you. Oh, just your driving alone angers me. I know, I don't even have to try. You really don't. Okay, so I saw the clip like a few days ago that we did when we were getting the seats on this thing redone. Mm -hmm. Whoa, is that a bomber? That's a bomber. Look at that thing. Huh. Yeah. Someone told me I need to run away from Where's you. Where's it at? Oh, it's underneath the clouds. Yeah. There it is, dude. That's a bomber. Yeah. That's a bomber right there. Yeah. That thing's a bomber right there. Look at that bomber. We saw a boom. I usually see bombs in Bradenton. I've never seen one out here. Yeah. So that clip the other day, like, someone said I need to run away from you. I wish you would. Yeah, I'm not Unless going to. With less mouths to feed around here. They don't get it's a it's a comedy. I'm not going thing. anywhere. It's they don't like, they don't get it's comedy. It's like some people are just they don't understand it's all comedy. I don't think people understand Anything. how I am into natural medicine and whatnot. Like oh, you're very healthy. No, like the vitamins and supplements. Oh I take. yeah, yeah. You eat five pounds a day of that stuff. I think there's probably like extra. Jose, how much money have you spent on natural health for me? Not as much as I've spent on food. But it's quite, quite substantial, Andy, right? We're not. We don't want to hear this crap. Anna. Okay. We know you have a substance abuse habit when it comes to food, and we're not going to believe your crap. You're not going to convince me that you're healthy. We've done this a thousand times. You're unhealthy. I know I'm not healthy. Okay. I take vitamins to try to be healthy. Maybe you should stop taking vitamins. I think there's already enough vitamins in you. There might be a surplus of vitamins somewhere in there. People don't understand it's common. Like, they're just so dumb. Yeah. They're like, I would leave him. Leave honey. him if he wants to. I would leave him, you. honey. I'm like, I deworm myself. Honey, you need to leave him. He's no good for you. Dude, if you eat pork, you should be deworming yourself. That's not even the point. Yeah. The point is just that they don't understand that it's comedy. Like, they don't understand that we're here to entertain people. Yeah. And get comments and, like... You can complain all you want. I, I'll take, I'll take your complaints to my bank account. <laughs> the guy's just running around in a tractor. Why is he on track? In the words of Eminem, you can complain all you want. I'll be laughing at the bank. Yeah. Yeah. 
Can you stop corning trashy people? Can you stop burn? Hey, look! Don't look at me. Look at the road. Yeah. <laughs> don't look at me. Look at the road. That shows don't understand it's comedy. Yeah. It's like, what do they think? Like when we're home alone, all he's doing is wow. Like, yeah. Dude, slow down with the door down. Yeah. We're going sixty, which is probably the speed limit. What do they think the entire time we're home? You're like yelling at me. And Go on. Hitting me. Yeah, bro. No. Hit me, baby, one more time. <laughs> that is not our household. Free Katie. Okay. That's like Parish over there. There's like a wall around it. I thought the dirt mount was like Parish. I'm just gonna take a left on 37. How far is that? 16 miles or something. Ah. Yeah, buddy, it's a solid truck. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seems like it's not a to see a moose. I mean, they've seen, like, weird animals in weird places in Florida. I don't know that place where you can definitely see a moose. I wouldn't be surprised if you saw a rhino on your daily commute here in Florida. Yeah. Look at it. Or a giraffe. Random giraffe. Yeah, you can see anything in Florida. Abiding folks here in Florida. We are law abiding people. Is that why we have uh, boa constrictors in the Everglades? Like pythons. Yeah. yeah. All these non native snakes in the Everglades. Why well, you gotta be racist, Katie? What? Just because they weren't born here doesn't mean they don't belong here. What's it saying? People are hunting. Three miles ahead. There's something three miles ahead. That's all I can get. Probably a flagger. Tampa Bay Farms. We're in the Tampa Bay area. Hey, don't look at me. Look at the road. You could have drove. I'm in too much pain to drive. Okay. I got a new rule. If you want to complain, you can drive. I don't even think I can sit here as a passenger. Well, you doing it. I'm a little grumpy today. Yeah, I can tell. It's heavy, yeah. Why are the cows laying down? Just bunch of Sabu's laying down right there. Yeah. I didn't know cows did that. They're like all laying down. It's number five degrees. Hey, this guy's just littered. Piglet. Saw truck! Can you believe we live in a society where people have to ship grass around? Mm -hmm. Does that even make sense? Doesn't the grass just grow somewhere? We've, we've created environments where grass seed. won't. Yeah. We live in an environment where grass won't grow in some places. What type of world do we live in where we have to well, ship people grass? people want pretty grass. It's not pretty grass. It's just like we live in a world where grass won't grow in some environments, so we have to like ship it from other environments. What type of world are we creating? Hey, I'm don't get past back here right now. Make pet back okay, right now. Even the Kia driver had enough of your driving. Yeah. You've had enough of my driving. You're about to get out and walk. Yeah. I have to find a park or something where I could walk. Oh. Dang it, man. I'm 
not gonna end up on pain post for the rest of my life. You're not taking them. I'm not taking none of that crap. I'll end up homeless and brains and like, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. I can understand a little bit, but it no, shouldn't no, be no. happening to begin with. Yeah, buddy. This is nice out here. Yeah. Get 150 acres and plow the field with an ATV all day. For what it costs, house costs here, you can get a house on 100 acres in Montana. Yeah. you're an infertile American. Americans are infertile. Jose? If I had married a Mexican woman, we'd have like 10 kids around. Jose? Americans are infertile. Jose? Just saying. Fact? Just saying. I don't see Thanks people. Thanks for blasting out my information on the internet. Nobody said it. Well, it's not your information. It's um, Americans are just generally infertile in general. You're the one who made it known it was your information. Look at three canes over there in the field. See, they're not infertile. They have two babies. Americans are infertile. Like, I don't see Mexicans having fertility issues. Especially the ones across the sea where we live in Naples. They have like 10 kids. Don't look at me. Look at the road. Americans are infertile. That's a problem with America. Fertility. Fertility. I like this lonely palm tree here. Ow! <laughs> you can't hit me, I'm already in pain. I hit a part that wasn't in pain. <laughs> yeah, how could you hit somebody who's already suffering? Look at all this farm equipment. So, you know, we didn't find out who the real abuser in this relationship is. <laughs> but nobody cares about me! You had it coming. <laughs> nobody cares about me getting hit. If it was the other way around, they'd be calling Child Protective Services. But since you're the one being the abuser, nobody gives a crap about I'm me. I'm not an abuser. They heard that. They heard it. And nobody's going to call Child Protective Services on you. Jose, mm -hmm. you're an adult. I'm already in pain, dude. What the crap? What's this person doing in the ditch? Farmer stuff, you know, just in a ditch. Some nice farmland out here. Palm trees and wallabies, you know what I mean? I'm not talking to you anymore. You hate me. Okay. How can you hit somebody who's already suffering? That's just like, it takes a heartless person. Jose. And by the way, unless a doctor says you're infertile, you're not infertile. You can't diagnose yourself because you think you're infertile. I think that's a doctor who make that determination. Okay. Take me to one. I'm not paying for a doctor. Exactly. That's my rim tire gold chain budget right there. Exactly why there's a free Katie Boo <laughs> What's up with this eight foot fence? Is there like deer jumping through this fence or something? Like what's up with the eight foot fence? They had so many deer jumping around here that they got eight foot fence. Here's a park. A community park. From Manatee County. We're still in Manatee County. Yeah. Nice. Manatee County has a diverse landscape. 
especially around the mosaic thing. I think got all types of landscapes out there. You got mountain landscape out there. You got moon landscape, Mars, Neptune landscape, Pluto landscape, surface of the sun landscape out there. Koala walla walla, koala walla me, koala walla you, koala walla poo. I'm not when I play with them, when I race that light, I'm not beat them on. And I'm not when not, not hit the yalem, I'm not style them, and I hit the yalem. Now she goes scream. And the subscribers gonna call the police on me because I hit her with my fist across the screen. I hit her across the head, now she gonna scream. Oh look, they're picking blueberries. Nice. Yeah. Strawberries. Uh, no, these are uh, strawberries or blueberries? Strawberries. strawberries. I see the red. Mm. Yeah. Look at all those American citizens doing the jobs that Hispanics didn't want to do. There's nobody in the field. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, didn't really work out the way you thought it would, would it? So up ahead. It's Highway 37. Okay. Two miles. Okay. Wachula! Wachula with the Ula. I can't believe we're still in Manatee County. It just kind of looks like a mockery out here. We must have kicked up a lot of rocks because they're flying all yeah, out. Yeah, this road's kind of like falling apart. Okay. With the mosaic thing, you could see a rhino out here. Like a four horn. Five headed round. Just bleh. Or a ten foot chicken. <laughs> you know, ten foot curly tailed chicken down there. Just walking class chicken down there. Just it, 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 it's just dang old German Shepherd mix. You would have to be. You already hit me once. Isn't that enough for you? What? Not every time you raise your hand, I get scared. You're an idiot. It sure was nice to see 40 U.S. citizens picking strawberries out there in the field. I didn't see any. <laughs> and the guy on the tractor? Yeah, these Hispanics are taking all the good jobs Americans want to do, like picking blueberries or strawberries in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I ain't doing that. Ronda Guido down there, he had a great idea. In half a mile, turn left onto Florida 37 North. Not the first, it's not the first road, it'll be the second one to the left. But here's the first one you're passing, it's not this one, it's the next one. See where the red car came out of? Yeah. That's where you're going. I can't believe we're still in Manatee County. It's ours. We'll be in post soon. Turn left onto Florida 37 North. Wachula. Wachula with the Ula. Continue on Florida 37 North for 24 miles. Dang, that's a long ride, dog. Yeah, but we'll be a mulberry soon, you hear me? What's the semi doing on the other lane? No Is he passing an invisible vehicle? Be careful, there might be something on the road. He's out or he's stoned out of his mind. Well, why'd he do that? Be careful. Is there something on the road? No, there's something Why was he doing that? It's like an invisible... He passed an invisible car? Yeah. What was that about? I'm sorry, I'm confused. What was that about? You just passed an invisible car. <laughs> GTA has made it to Florida. Invisible cars driving around. What was the point of that? No idea. There's like literally nothing on the road. Maybe he's from England or something. Maybe he's, in, maybe he's England, these. Joe. Think you could be Englandese? Yeah, I don't know. Have you ever met somebody that's Englandese? I don't know someone who's in it, but not Englandese. 
Englandese. Somebody from England's called an Englandese. No, they're called English. Englandese. Or Indian Asian. Englandesian. Englandesian. Indonesia. I think we're driving past, uh, yeah, we're passing past Mosaic now. So Mosaics destroy the earth. And the surrounding area. We're going to ship fertilizer halfway around the world and hope they're not enriching uranium with it. Damn! Just destroying it. We're for, probably gonna go back to Iron Town at some point. I mean, it was interesting enough the first time. I'm having trouble getting across the county. You're talking about an international road trip to another country, Canada. Awesome. You better not, Howard Jay. Ohio's practically Canada. Let's just be honest. If there was one U.S. state that we had to cede to Canada. I think it would definitely be Ohio. I mean, it borders Canada, right? No, Michigan borders Canada. Uh -huh. Um. Okay, Ohio, and then we can give them Detroit too, and then that way they can have a land crossing. They can make a bridge from uh. Yeah, they, there's already a ferry from Sandusky. We've been to Sandusky. Mm -hmm. They can just make a bridge from Sandusky to the other side. Yeah, we could we'd give Ohio. If there was, if like Canada, like we had to give them, like we lost the war of Canada, we had to give them one state, I'm pretty sure it'd be Ohio. But don't worry, like Michigan would be a great option too. They can keep that. Yeah, buddy, look at that jacked up truck. Are you mad at me? Oh, you're from Michigan? Oh, I'm sorry. No, babe. We'll give them Ohio. Yeah, I'm sorry. Or both. <laughs> what is wrong with you? If we just hung around here, maybe my back pain will go away. And all the chemicals coming out of the ground. Jose. Rearrange my cells. And... I don't think it's that positive, but let's go. Maybe I'll keep going. So we're driving through fields of destruction, believe it or not. This is like a mining area of Florida. They're, they're mining phosphate for fertilizer and shipping it halfway around the world. There it is, mosaic. And as we all know, it makes perfect sense to ship uranium enriched materials halfway around the world to countries that are really in desperate need of fertilizer. Here's Polk County, no second. Polk County! Yeah! Let me just throw this out the window. I don't want Ray to catch me. Out here. That fart that you made it didn't want to acknowledge? No, I just had some stuff I didn't want to make. I don't I don't want to go to Polk County Jail with Grady Judd catch me out here. You didn't throw anything out. You know one thing I really like about Polk County, these folks are friendly out here. Just real mild tempered kind folks. You wouldn't see any lawlessness out here or anybody acting irrationally. Just 
up this guy. Yeah, buddy's got a gym, say Silverado. Rest in peace, Earth. South of Lakeland. About 15 miles south of Lakeland. Alright, y'all.